Don't you pack the flashlight, the blanket, and the mat? It's a real adventure, the trail you're looking at. I'm glad you came for a while. Everyone, and welcome to Friday, I think. <laughs> oh my goodness, don't know why my hair is a mess. I literally showered last night, so <laughs> I'm a little bit like, hmm, today. I've run out of a few of my food. And um, yeah, I tried to see if I could get some Asda groceries and Burfield boot for like the middle of April. And then I tried Tesco's and they're pretty much fully booked to the middle of uh, April. And then I tried to sign up to Sainsbury's. They weren't having it. They won't accept new customers just now. So yeah, they were on to me. So <laughs> that didn't work out. So. I don't know what I'm going to do. <sighs> the dogs of which we got three, maybe four days worth of dog cans. Now, there's three full cans. So, to maybe make it last a little longer, and I know this is a really cruel thing to do. But I have treats and stuff, so I can give them extra on that. But for the actual dog meat, I'm only going to give them like half a can each. Um, so like, I'll split the half of the can and then I'll divide it between them so that they have at least <clears throat> they have at least like three cans for six days if that makes sense so yeah that's my only plan until I can get some wet dog food for the dogs um, I don't really have <clears throat> Sorry, my throat is really bad today because I've got really bad acid reflux and it's given me a bit of a, a really bad cough. And no, I don't have corona. I just have a bad cough. Yes, I just took my vitamins. They smell like orange. <laughs> that's why I'm, I'm, if you see me cough, and that's why I sound like I have been strangled or something for a long time. And that's why my voice sounds really strained and whatever. Because basically the acid came right up into my throat yesterday. And my throat was literally on fire. And I was in a lot of pain yesterday. Hence why I didn't vlog. Because when I was speaking it was just a bit of a struggle to speak. And I didn't sound very good. And it's a bit better today. And I figured I'd make a vlog. So yeah. And plus, I was really anxious yesterday. The night before, I think it was Wednesday night, I had a, like, a really bad, bad panic attack. Like, the worst panic attack I've ever had. And I couldn't breathe. Literally, couldn't breathe. When I could, but it was just my anxiety making me think I couldn't. And I was, like, freaking out and panicking, and it was just making it worse. I'm thinking it's just that the lack of sleep recently, and just, yeah, my anxiety just went a little bit quickly. <laughs> And the lack of walks, but I'm going to have to get used to it because I think we're probably going to be going into some sort of isolation lockdown soon. She just fell over. Are you alright, Bob? Are <laughs> you alright? Are you ready to go into isolation, pups? Are you ready? We're going to be stranded in this house and I'm going to have you crawling on me every day. Oh God, send help. <laughs> I don't know. We're going to have to come up with some fun things to do. I think, you know how, like, in January, I was doing that circle thing, going round and round in circles around the house. I'm thinking I'm going to have to do that. Though, one of the doorways where I come out of, like, coming from the kitchen to the living room, yeah, it was a mouse there. <laughs> it might be a little bit difficult, but we'll see. <laughs> I don't want to annoy the mouse at all, but we'll see. I'm going to just have to do it, or I'm going to up and down the stairs or something, or the exercise bike, and just... You know, take my chances with my, my spine or coccyx injury and just, yeah, if I hurt it, I hurt it because I'll be stuck in here for a long time, so it doesn't matter if I re-hurt it. Yeah, you agree? You agree? If I hurt it, I hurt it, right? Yeah? <laughs> Look at little creep. Just ignore all that over there, by the way. It's some books and things. I've been reading. I know. What's happening to me? I'm reading books. <laughs> this is going to be my life for the next however long if we go into lockdown. We're going insane as it is because... I hope my anxiety has been so bad recently, we haven't been able to go for walks, so... 
it's going to be a crazy couple of weeks. Boris Johnson was saying something about he thought it was going to go until like end of June. No chance. <laughs> but I guess we'll just have to get on with it. I mean, to be fair, I practiced for this for the last five weeks, you know? I could give people tips. <laughs> As long as people get better and as long as people don't die, that's the most important thing. That's all I care about. And that we can kick Corona's backside and tell it to bugger off. Then I'll be happy. You might be bailing. Is that the same yellow shirt you used to wear? But a thousand years seem like almost no time now. This guitar right here, do you still remember how? I played for you, I was crappy, but you sang along and I thought you knew I could die to keep you near We've got a fire in the tent, it's 5.30 a.m. Let's be the kids who left get in trouble again That stuff got nothing on you, that was brand new Still it's got nothing on you tonight I don't need to go over old Hey everyone and welcome to Saturday. So I'm about to have one of these. I've really been addicted to these recently over the last few months but I've never really had the mango ones I don't think so I'm trying these and this is not like an ad or anything. Just to clarify. <laughs> I am super excited though. Today I finally get some gavas going for my acid reflux. You know how yesterday I sounded like someone had strangled me and I couldn't speak properly? Yeah. Well, I, I finally get some uh, gavas going today. It's like little liquid sassies, but they'll do. It's the only thing I could find, but it'll do. <laughs> and my friend, I don't know if I updated you guys yesterday, my friend Maria thankfully um it's gonna help me out and get me some stuff that i need because the dogs are running out of food and stuff like that so i will be fine from monday onwards for food and toilet roll and all that fun stuff so yeah so when if we end up going into lockdown i'm all right <laughs> and i've uh, i've managed to find like um some dog food on amazon but when it'll get here, I have no idea. But when it does, we have dog food for the dogs. It's just a case I'm going to have to be a little bit smart with the dog food for just now. And I have some chicken in the freezer. It's frozen chicken. So maybe with some meals, maybe I'll just give them chicken as well with dry dog food. And, you know, kind of mix it up. I don't have rice. I don't have any pasta. And I very much doubt my friend will be able to get any rice and pasta. So I could have given them that, like, with their meal and some chicken but you know it's not it's like really hard to find chicken and pasta right now so i don't know we're gonna have to figure something out if, if anyone's got any recipes or stuff that i can give the dogs so we can get through this for however long i mean they're thinking that it might be three months by the time this is all over three months the end of june <laughs> i don't have enough food to last to the end of june for them or me so Hopefully, it won't be as scary as I'm thinking it is in my head, and we'll, we'll manage, and it'll be fine, but we'll see. <laughs> Ruby, I think, is currently playing with her bone. Well, will keep your teeth all good, won't it? Yeah, you get your bone. Get it, man. Get that bone. Get it. I don't know if you can see it, but there's a bird right up there, and it was on my windowsill just staring in, watching me just now. Maybe you missed that one. <laughs> sitting right, right there, just sitting there, staring in at the window right here. That doesn't happen every day, does it, Daisy? <laughs> oh my goodness. Hey everyone, and welcome to Sunday. 
Oh my goodness, what a way to start the day. And yes, I'm wearing the same pajamas, don't judge me. <laughs> oh my goodness, that is crazy. I don't know if yesterday I told you in the vlog, but we had a cat sitting on the back window, just sitting, staring, watching us, just live our lives. Bit of a creepy cat. <laughs> and then we had like a pigeon sitting, chilling on the summer house. Or a shed, actually. Um, and it was, like, just chilling. <laughs> just sitting there chilling. I don't know why all of a sudden this house is, like, the animal whisperer. And all these animals are just sitting on my window sills and just watching me. Uh, it's a bit weird. <laughs> I don't know why all of a sudden all these animals are here. I mean, next I'm going to, like, you know, see, like, some... Dog just sitting there, like watching me. He's gonna just, yeah. <laughs> oh my goodness, I don't know what's going on. The world's gone crazy. We all go into isolation, and then the animals decide, hey, I'm gonna see how we ever have with. I'm just gonna just go in there and I'm just gonna be a little snitch and I'm just gonna watch them. I don't know what's going on. It's a bit strange. This never happens. We don't normally have pigeons just chewing some baby on the said roof. That hasn't happened in years. And we don't normally have like cats and birds watching us through the window. I mean, they're just a little creepy. Someone might want to tell them that. Our friend's gone, buddy. You missed it. Yo, if Ruby had seen that bird, yo, that would have been bad. <laughs> I'm glad she didn't see it. Yesterday when she saw the cat, it took her an hour to realise the cat had gone. And she kept like jumping along the, the wall there, thinking that if she jumped high enough, she could probably jump through the window. <laughs> She's a bit creepy. Cray -cray. Ain't she? Oh, am I getting cuddles? Am I getting cuddles? Hmm? Oh, okay. Is he? No kisses allowed, okay? Do you not listen to the news? No? You don't care? You're not allowed to kiss me? Technically not allowed to hug me either. So bye bye. Oh, you are a rule breaker. You're a rule breaker. I like it. Good duck. <laughs> Stop mooning the neighbors. Stop mooning the neighbors. No one wants to see your butt. Ain't a good look. Ain't a good look, bro. Yeah, the, beat, the bird's gone. The bird's gone. You missed it. You're too slow. Yeah. Baby, come here. 